Shoots County, Oregon. My name is Miles McLaughlin here at Wilco Land. What we do is we buy and sell raw vacant land, a mission to make these properties affordable to folks out there um, and provide what we think unique and epic properties. So um, again, a small land investment here out of South Dakota. I'm going to walk through this property, what I know about it, cover a lot of FAQs in it. Um, I do want to start the video like all my other videos saying, hey, this is not real estate advice, this is not legal advice. I'm one of the owners of the property, simply sharing my opinions and thoughts on the property from my time and experience in the industry. Um, so going through these photos, um, you know, sharing kind of some aerial imagery. This is an area down by Lapine and Sun River, Oregon in Deschutes County. Um, really a popular area for folks looking to RV, maybe build a shop or some sort of garage with electricity, with RVs, setups, stuff like that. I'll give you guys some examples of what folks are doing with these type of properties. So really a great location, just overall a nice property, a nice area. Um, you know, going into this listing a little bit more, we're, we're really close to Bend. We're right by the Deschutes River and the Little Deschutes River. Um, I do want to say something in the past, you know, back in 1992, and things could be different, you know, this property failed a septic test, right? Um, you may be able to get maybe an above ground system approved, sand filter system, maybe mound system, something like that. Maybe there's new technology out that, you know, this is 20, 30 years down the road now. We're 20, 30 years down the road. This, the soil, the landscape, the drainage of this property could have changed. We have not done any additional information um, on this denied um, septic evaluation back from 1992. What does this mean for the property? So this is not uncommon for this neighborhood. So I want to jump right into this. This is the reason for the price, right? If this had passed a septic test, this is worth $200,000, right? We have it priced about a quarter of that. And so what are folks doing? So, you know, it's allowed to build like a storage building on these properties. Many people are building these storage units for the recreational vehicles, snowmobiles, boats, RVs. Um, you could do another perk test to potentially build down the road. Maybe there's technology that comes out in the future that allows you to, to have some sort of sewage disposal system for living there permanently. But let me just show you some ideas. So I pulled these off Zillow. Here's what folks are doing with these type of properties out here that fail septic systems. This is one of them, right? Um, this is sweet. I mean, they're just putting together RV pads with these properties. Let me pull up another one. Um, so this isn't uncommon, you know, and these are going for quarter million dollars or more, right? You pick up a property from us for 60 grand or whatever the listing price is, you put a hundred into it. I mean, there's a lot of equity to be had. I mean, so you can see folks are developing on these properties, doing just really easy, um, type of garages on these lots and you can run power to them and things like that. You could probably even get a well in. So you have running water, but this is your idea, right? You're parking an RV, you're, you're putting your toys on the property. So I wanted to share this with folks that do really think it's a, it's a creative new way of looking at land investing and looking at ways to use property. It's not so traditional as it once was, right? Um, people are getting creative with land investments in these really great locations like Bend, Oregon. Um, so uh, I do have it pulled up. I have Zillow pulled up here too, just talking about the market a little bit. You can see our listing here on Zillow um, for 59.5. Um, obviously, like I mentioned in this video, we're open to cash offers. We'll offer seller financing. Uh, 13 days on Zillow, a lot of activity here. Um, so you can see we're the lowest price on the market. We're doing that for a reason. We're in the business of selling land fast. Um, again, this is a great, what I call recreational land investment outside of Bend, Oregon. I'll pull up the location on a map for you here. Um, you can see Bend. We're between Bend and Lapine, like in Three Rivers in Sun River, Oregon. Um, I'll pull it up here on Onyx Maps. This is my favorite app to use for land viewings. Um, so I really recommend using Onyx Maps. All you're using this is the GPS coordinates. You can see if I zoom in here, this is some sort of garage that's been built on this property. Um, you can see folks are using these type of properties for storage, garages, shops, RVs, things like that. So um, again, I think our lot is this um, more in Douglas. So um, we're looking at half an acre. Just picked it up recently off Kingsburg Berg Road out here in Deschutes County, Oregon. You know, that's all I've got to show on the property. If you want to learn more about the zoning, um, I do have a link to the zoning website right here. And um, it's part of Deschutes River Recreational Home Sites. So um, they have a website as well you can explore um, to do a little bit more homework too. So that's it. I do have other properties in Oregon. I've got one in Mount Hood, Oregon right now and a few other locations. Give us a call if you have questions. We specialize in land investments across the Mountain West, the Inland Northwest, um, all the way out to the coast. Um, so 605 299 53 is a good way to reach us. Again, Miles here at Wilco Land sharing a new Deschutes County property with you. Thanks for tuning in.